Thank you for the introduction and uh, good evening, every uh, audience. Mm, I'm, I'm Jato from the Pediatric Oncology Center in Mercy City Cancer Center. And today, the topic I will present is the effect of cell beauty therapy on pediatric refractory or elastic, not cell lymphoma. First, I will introduce the elastic left cell lymphoma. Uh, Lablastic uh, left cell lymphoma accounts for approximately 10% of childhood non Hodgkin lymphoma cases. Unlike mature B cell or lymphoblastic lymphoma, the survival rates for patients with recurrent or refractory elastic blood cell lymphoma is 40% to 60%. Uh, the present study is to analyze clinical char characteristics associated with childhood refractory or relapsed elastic blood cell lymphoma. Uh, AOCL and outcome of R, R or R AOCL treated with salvage therapy. And I will summarize the patient demographics. The boys accounted for 60%, uh, 21 patients, and the female only accounted for 40%. The median age of the cohort is, was 8 years old. The uh, the youngest patient uh, is only uh, 0.42 years old, and the oldest person is 15 years old. The median uh, bleeding level of LDH was 246 uh, units per liter, and the 22 patients were, were in relapsed condition, and the 13 patients were a uh, remain rescue disease or in progression state. And the pathological subtype uh, is, com is, is uh, common at most 16 patients. And uh, the other patients include, including, including uh, lymphoplastic, lymphoplastic, and small cell subtype, and Hodgkin subtype, and the ILK scanning is positive in, in 32 patients. And the first nine chemotherapy uh, included BFM 19, 19 in 29 patients. Uh, we know the treatment uh, is, uh, is uh, um, the salvage therapies included several options for relapsed or refractory patients. Um, among the patients receiving gemcitabine, um, 15 patients, among the 15 patients, 6 patients achieved complete response, and 3 patients had partial response disease, and 1 patient had stable disease. Among the patients receiving blasting, um, it's a total of 17 patients, 9 patients achieved complete response, and 3 patients uh, were in partial response, and one patient was in stable disease condition, and four patients developed progressive disease, and other patients received uh, gemcitabine based combination cell chemotherapy, and five patients received critizotomy, and two patients achieved complete response. Objective response rates of gemcitabine and the blasting was 60% and 71.1% respectively. Other effective, effective salvage therapy included brentuximide, vitotin, gemcitabine based multi agent chemotherapy, keratinizotative, and CC regimen. We analyzed the monotherapy of vinblastin. About 17 patients receiving vinblastin, 9 had complete response, 3 had partial response, 8 had stable disease. The shortest period of time to objective response in the responders was two weeks, and the longest course was 30 months. Just to show in the number, case number. With regard, with regard to monotherapy of gemcitabine, uh, among 15 patients receiving, receiving gemcitabine, six had complete response, three had partial response, one had stable disease, and five had disease progression. Among the patients who had continuous complete response, 
the total cycles of chemotherapy were up to six cycles of survival. After leading a follow-up of 58 months, the median survival time was for the refractory or relapsed epileptic blood cell lymphoma was not reached. 23 patients were in continuous remission, 9 in CR, and 12 died until the next follow-up. The three-year EFS and OS rate was 35.8%. And 68.5% respectively. One patient died of transplant associated complications, and the remaining patients died of progression, as shown in the survival curves. Discussion. We know there are several effective salvage therapies optional for R or ALCL single beam blasting or gemstabbing or gemstabbing based chemotherapy. Are effective treatment modalities. Thank you.